<laughs> what? No. Be serious. Close your eyes. Honey, come on, baby. I need you to trust me. I'm not going to do anything to you. You know, I prefer if your eyes are open if I'm going to do anything to you. This is just a special little gift that I've prepared. Trust me, darling. Please, close your eyes. Yes, thank you. Finally. Does it take you this long to listen? <laughs> listen, I've got a special prize for you. And just for you, princess. Yes, of course. Hold on, hold on. Be patient. Relax. Don't ruin your surprise. Tiger, come on. I got this for you. Mm -hmm. Can you feel it? Yeah, wrap your hands around it. Touch it. Feel soft, right? Yes. Can you guess what that is? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a box. And what type of box do you think it is? Ah, oh, come on, baby. It's not that big. Think what belongs in a tiny box. Honey, it's a soft, fuzzy, tiny box. What do you think it is? <sighs> okay, fine. Open your eyes. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Tiger, relax, okay? It's not what you think it is, but it is what you think it is. Honey, it's, it's a ring. Yeah, I got us. I got us rings. Oh, call me cheesy, but I just like the idea of promise rings. And I don't see you promising yourself to anybody else, so may as well <laughs> do it. Yes, yes, I did have to. No, no, please don't. Are you kidding? Don't worry yourself about that. I picked up a couple extra shifts. It's not that big of a deal. Let me just say this. There is no price that could be put on my love for you. None. No price belongs there. So, don't you worry about the cost. Trust me. No matter what, you're worth every single cent. That's and more. I actually thought that this wouldn't be good enough. I mean, the jewel is nice. It's pretty. I like it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yes, my darling, of course. This is symbolic for everything that I would ever do for you. I want it to be the promise that you and I one day, when we're ready, we're going to take the next steps and, you know, do a little, a little ceremony thingy. <laughs> nah, it's so lame. I can't say it like that. No, I'm internally cringing at myself. Okay, I'm sorry that I'm so self-conscious. Fine. I want to promise. Okay, look at me. Look at me, baby. Right here. Yes, good. I want us to promise that we will one day be final. We will be the last of each other's relationships. That there's no more dating. No more trying to figure it out. None of that. 
I just want there to be us. And that's all. That's all. That's all there needs to be. Just us. I can't imagine a life without you. I don't want to. In fact, I refuse to. I would never want to be away from you for longer than hours. Even that's pushing it. I know that I can be impulsive, possessive, very clingy, and a complete dumbass. Please forgive me for that. And despite my shortcomings, despite all of it, you still somehow make me feel like I'm the best man in the world. And I want to make you feel like the best woman in the world. I want to do that for you. I want to do that and so much more to you. I wish to mark your soul with my embrace every single day. I want you to drown in my heart, in my love. And I want you to cut me open, split me in two, and take a nap inside of all that I have to offer. And I hope that there's enough room inside of me to make you happy, to please you, to make you feel good, to make you smile. I just, I hope it's enough. It's all I got. <laughs> Better be enough. You kidding? I'm joking. <laughs> I just am confident that I mean, it's the only thing I'm confident in, at least, is that nobody, and I mean absolutely nobody, will make you happier than me. Not in the way that you deserve. I see you when you come home so exhausted, so tired, and you just need lay down in my arms, have me nibble on your neck, whisper in your ear how beautiful you are, because you are, how proud of you I am, because you're amazing, and how happy it makes me feel to be your partner, to be yours. Listen, I'm yours. I'm yours, tiger. I'm all yours. Whenever you want, whenever you need. No matter what, you could come home tomorrow and tell me that you accidentally killed, like, I don't know, 10 people. Accidentally. Let's be hypothetical. And you know what my first response would be? Where are we going to bury them? Ah, <laughs> oh, that is so, so insane, stupid, and totally not the typical response, but it just goes to show I'm crazy in love with you. And I trust that you won't go around killing 10 people. That's why I can confidently say that. It's like when push comes to shove, I'm there, but like, don't, don't push. Don't, don't go doing that, darling, please. <laughs> I'd prefer not. Life is so much easier when you're not on the run, you know? Okay, I know you don't know that. I'm talking, okay, figuratively, uh, whatever. Does everything have to be so literal with you? Like you couldn't even figure out what thing you were holding in your hand. It was small and fuzzy. Come on. 
<sighs> you lack imagination. But for what you lack, I will gladly make up. I will be what you can't be, just as you are what I can never be. You're kind, sweet, loving. You're that happiness that I want to steal because I spent so long struggling to find that within myself. Would you know, when it was you and I, everything just pieced together, everything just fit inside perfectly. And I love that. I'm so grateful for that. I tell you a million times over, I owe you everything because it's true. I owe you my life, darling. So whatever it is that you ask of me, I will give it. This, I promise, I promise today and I promise for eternity. So my love, would you share this promise with me and accept this promise ring? And I promise to always be yours. I love you.